Hello guys and welcome back to Intel Media, here we give you all the information you need to know about new movies and upcoming series, from storylines, cast, release date and news. Don't forget to subscribe now to Intel Media and push the bell icon so you don't miss any of our daily videos. What a trip the Umbrella Academy Season 2 was. Five ensured that his siblings weren't blitzed to a pulp by the apocalypse in Season 1, jumping himself and them through time and space to the 60s straight into the path of another apocalypse. Ben was able to stop her from ripping the world a new one, which in turn allowed Vanya to help Harlan, who was on the brink of total destruction after she gave him powers that mirrored hers. The gang also dodged death at the hands of the handler and Lila, the latter is still out there, unlike her, mother, more on them later after the duo waged war on the Umbrella Academy. But all is not well. The siblings made it back to Hargreaves HQ, only to learn that it now belongs to the Sparrow Academy. There really is never a dull moment, is there? The Umbrella Academy should be able to relax now, but something's not quite right as they've come back, showrunner Steve Blackman told Digital Spy. Not only are these people saying they're the Sparrow Academy, but Reginald Hargreaves is still alive, and he shouldn't be, either. And expect, tons of Easter eggs, too, added Blackman. We love putting Easter eggs in for our fans, and there's more Easter eggs than ever this year. What we're trying to say is, there's a lot more life left in this story yet. But when will it be back for season 3? Here's everything you need to know. It's official. The Umbrella Academy season 3 is happening, with 10 brand new episodes on their way. As for when those episodes will be reaching us, well, news is just in. The new season will be arriving June 22, 2022 and is set to answer some of those burning questions that have plagued us since season 2's shock ending in 2020. Filming for season 3 wrapped a while ago but given just how vital special effects are to this series, it's entirely unsurprising that the wait has been so long. Visual effects supervisor Everett Burrell told Gold Derby that the apocalyptic vision that features in season 2 took, months and months, to plan, adding, a lot of the feature film effects tools have now trickled down into the TV industry, so we're able to get bigger and more epic looking stuff. Dot dot. So every season we have to top ourselves by utilizing the newest and best tools that we can get a hold of. Justin H. Min, Ben, will be returning for season 3, except this time he's not a member of the Umbrella Academy, but the Sparrow Academy, whatever the hell that is. And clearly, he's not Ben anymore, judging by that hair and seriously bad attitude. The rest of the Hargreaves gang will also be back given that they were, against all odds, alive and kicking at the end of season 2, so that's, Vanya Elliott Page 5 Aidan Gallagher Klaus Robert Sheehan Allison Emmy Raver Lampman Diego David Castaneda Luther Tom Hopper and Reginald Colm Fior. There's also newcomer Lila Ritu Arya who, we now know, can do everything the siblings can do, only better. Plus, we wouldn't be surprised to see Grace Jordan Claire Robbins and Pogo Adam Godley and Ken Hall again. Allison's husband Raymond, Yusuf Gatewood, and Vanya's love interest Sissy, Marin Ireland both stayed behind in the 60s, so it feels like their stories are done. Harlan, however, could pop up again in future given that he still has his powers. It's, wilder, bigger and zanier, than ever before, teased Blackman of season 3, whose setting has been confirmed to be Hotel Oblivion, adding, I think our emotional stories between this dysfunctional family, were just building it up even more. There's some very big surprises with the family this year. There are some amazing changes that people will love to sort of dig into, and there's a lot of growth for this family this year in a way that people are just not going to expect. The Umbrella Academy loves wrong-footing viewers, employing twists and turns aplenty to shock and surprise. And according to Paige, the cast, too, are often bowled over by the myriad sizable developments along the way. Well, I feel like I was surprised often, because one of the delightful things about the show is as we read the scripts, a lot of things are unknown to us, he said, via Netflix. So I feel like there's always delightful surprises. At the end of season 2, we're led to believe that the handler is dead and the commission, free from her iron grip, will undergo some much needed reform. But like we said, we wouldn't be remotely surprised if she popped up again in another fabulous pair of heels with a bigger and better plan up her sleeve. The handler's daughter Lila managed to flee at the end, but we'd bet good money on her rocking up in season 3. Will she stand with the Umbrella Academy, or use her powers against them? Fans will be holding out for that Lila Diego happy ending, so here's hoping they get one. But before we talk about happy endings, there's the small matter of the Sparrow Academy, which will, undoubtedly, raise a few eyebrows. 
Who are they? How did they come to be and what does this all mean for the Umbrella Academy? We can't really look to the comics for answers. While they have been introduced in the books, they're still pretty mysterious. However, Volume 4 of the comic, as yet unreleased, is named after the group, so you can expect some major development there, and the information co-creator Gerard Way's given on that book could point the way to Season 3's plot. According to Forbes, Volume 4 of the comic series will be called, Sparrow Academy. It deals with a very big reveal in the Umbrella Academy universe, something that had been secret for a long time, and our siblings learn a lot about what was happening behind the scenes, as well as discovering the true nature of some characters that have been with them since the beginning, said Way. As fans of the comics might remember, the Televator is a lift that allows users to travel across time and space. More than that though, it can also cross dimensions. If this device somehow ends up getting made in Season 3, then perhaps the Umbrella Academy will be able to return home one day. In the meantime, catch up on everything that happened in Season 2 with this handy timeline provided by Netflix right here. And at least we can analyze the official episode titles, which were released by Netflix as part of its massive TUDUM event back in June. They are in order. Meet the Family, World's Biggest Ball of Twine, Pocket Full of Lightning, Kugelblitz, Kindest Cut, Marigold, Auf Wiedersehen, Wedding at the End of the World, Six Bells, Oblivion, Meet the Family, Seems pretty obvious, that'll be our Sparrow's intro. World's Biggest Ball of Twine, will probably deal with the previous season's mess of timey-wimey escapades, pocket full of lighting, feels like a potential powers episode, or it could relate to the next episode. Dot dot, Kugelblitz, which is a scientific term for black holes formed by radiation, so make of that what you will. Meanwhile, Kindest Cut, feels like it could involve betrayal of some kind, speaking of plot. The Umbrella Academy official Instagram page recently dropped seven new sizzling promo pictures that could potentially be hiding some season 3 easter eggs. The shots show the Umbrella Gang minus one Ben, asterisk Saab, plus one Lila. Already that has head spinning at the suggestion that Lila could be joining the Umbrella Academy. This of course has given viewers an inkling of hope when it comes to the, Lego, romance. However that's not the only thing the photos are hinting at. The Umbrella Academy crew can be seen toting some very battered umbrellas that appear to have several gashes in the fabric. Birds flock overhead and it can be assumed that they are a quarrel of sparrows suggesting that a battle of the academies is on its way. What friction? More on that here. How will the Umbrella Academy feel, not only about being replaced by the sparrows but also having to face off against their brother, former brother Ben? While this will probably be particularly difficult for Vanya for whom Ben sacrificed his afterlife for, their touching goodbye a tearjerker, this will no doubt be an immense struggle for former addict Klaus. Klaus and Ben have always had a special connection, forced, but special nonetheless. Klaus' ability to see and speak to the dead somehow kept Ben more alive than he ought to be following his death as a teen. Over the course of season 1 and throughout season 2 Klaus was able to channel Ben's energy allowing Ben to use his own unique gifts through Klaus and eventually he is able to possess Klaus. Along with the news of a release date, fans were treated to, well not quite a trailer but a teaser clip. This follows the promo pictures which landed in February. If the selection of 7 images hinted at tension between the sparrows and the umbrellas then the trailer full on teases a showdown is on the horizon. How could it not be when Sir Reginald Hargreaves is responsible for raising both groups of super-powered humans? That's double the amount of emotional dysfunction. In the clip, the Umbrellas and the Sparrows square off to a dramatic musical score featuring violins, Vanya, weren't you supposed to have kicked that habit? Both number 1s, Luther Hargreaves, the Og, and Marcus Hargreaves, leader of the Sparrows and Pseudo-Luther, approach each other with a mono-a-mono -a -mono energy.